Hello everyone, here is Dr. Nassim with TB Tool. Today I bring the tutorial about visualization of genome collinearity, the requirements for the tools and the files include the tool include a one step MC scan X and a dual centenary plot. Both are available in TB Tools. And the file in files include the protein sequence files of our desire model organism and the gtf or gff files and the gene list we need these three files so in the first step we need one step mc scan x that we can search by using search option available in the top right corner of the tb tool just type one step mc scan x and the required files include first formatted protein files of our model organisms and the GTF or GFF files. So how to load? So first we need to load the genome sequence file of first organism and the corresponding GTF file, then the genome file or the protein file of second organism and its corresponding GTF file. Fifth one is to give it a, an output pathway and then press start. We need to wait for some time. It depends upon the size of uh, our files. So in, uh, in output we will get the following files but among these files we need only .ctl dot collinearity and gff files for further processing in the next step we will do the dual centenary plot and for this uh, we can search it in a tb tool same in using the search option in the right top corner of the tb tool by tapping dual centenary plot and the file requires are the dot ctl dot collinearity and the dot gff file which are generated in the last step so once we uh, open the dual centenary plot the tab looks like this which includes set tab file here we will set ctl file in the next is uh, we will set gff file and then the third option collinearity file and then press start after some time we will see a genome comparison between first organism to our second model organism and in the background we will see some uh, highlighted area these are the genome comparison between the chromosomes present in a genome but we want to visualize our genes of interest for this what we need to do we will go to the last step of dual centenary plot and give uh, the desired gene list in the gene list for highlight option and then press start after some times we will see the same plot but this time in this plot uh, our genes of interest are highlighted between the two chromosomes we can modify this gro uh, graph dimensions by going to the option given below change graph settings and then we will save the graph. It, this will also give the options to check the highlighted genes in the upper genome and the highlighted genes in the lower genome. We can press and see the corresponding genes. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. As always, thank you for watching. I will see you next time.